my beer was as cold as your heart. Hey man, it's Phil X, and I'm sitting down again because it's an acoustic guitar and it's a 1924. This is the oldest guitar we've ever done, 1924 Gibson. I'm blown away that I'm holding a guitar that old, really old. This is one of 12 known examples, known today. It's an L5 designed by Lloyd Lore. And uh, the color is called Cremona Brown, and it's all original. And it has a Verzi, V-I-R-Z-I. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. I don't know if it's Verzi or Verzi tone producer, which is, it's got a little disc inside that kind of floats between the front and the back, and uh, magically. And, uh, and this is the first guitar with hev holes, which they got the idea from violins and cellos and stand-up basses uh, from the Baroque period, if you know what I'm talking about. And this is the first pick guard ever. Ever. And uh, so this is um, quite a piece of history that I'm holding here. I'm very awesomely amazed. And it's signed by Lloyd Lore. Inside, right? See? You'd have to take it apart to see it, but it's there. But, and you don't want to do that, so. I met her in the club down in Osoho Where we drink champagne And it tastes just like cherry cola C-O-L-A cola She walked up to me and she asked me to dance I asked her name and in the background voice She said Lola La 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 Lola La 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 I'm not dumb but I can't understand How she walk like a woman and talk like a man on my Lola La 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 I was getting carried away there. I'm sorry. I'll take it back. I don't take it back. All right. Um, how about this one? Wait. This was a 12 string. It's not a 12 string, but I'm not playing an acoustic guy to do something. <laughs> How's my mic doing? I woke up this morning feeling fine. Turn on some music to start my day Oh, my a girl I used to know I closed my eyes and she slipped away Guitar! Not supposed to be done like that, but that's all I got. <laughs> all right. What am I going to do, man? Okay, I can't shred on this guitar because the action's a little high and it hardly has any frets because it's 1924 Gibson. So let's do another acoustic song that I may get through. All right, try this. Yeah, campfire style. Okay, this is campfire style without the campfire and other people singing along. In the QC. I hear you calling, but I can't come on right now. Me and boys are playing, and we just can't find the sound. Just a few more hours, and I'll be back home to you. I think I hear them calling. Oh, Beth, what can I do? What can I do? You say you're so empty That our child's just in a home I'm always somewhere else And you're always there alone 
Just a few more hours And I'll be back home to you I think I hear them calling Oh Beth, what can I do? Yeah Beth, what can I do? Okay, here's the problem here Everybody's going to be like, hey man, he hit some wrong chords. And yes, I did. I'll be the first to say, and I don't know which ones either. It just sounded wrong. I didn't know how to fix it on the spot. Give me a break. All right. What else we got on this sucker? Sucker. 1924, Gibson. Lloyd Lore. L5. First F halls. F hole. And first big card. And uh, what else we got here? Um, and I'm playing an acoustic, and Dusty made a request for some Ozzy Osbourne in this 1924 Gibson. Uh, Randy Rhodes. Uh, the record was uh, Diary of a Madman. The song is Diary of a Madman as well. And it goes like... <laughs> it's this finger. It just doesn't want to cooperate. That's when the Les Paul through the Marshalls come screaming through the speakers. All right, that was uh, Diary of a Madman by Ozzy Osbourne with Randy Rose on guitar, and I'm blah, 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 talking really fast. Hey, it's Phil Axe. Phil Axe. Axe. Phil Axe. Axe. That's it. Phil Axe signing out. Off. Done. See ya. <laughs>